We actually use this very often, like um, almost on a daily basis because it's super convenient. When you're just so tired, don't want to get out for school, <laughs> you just have to use this and one minute you're done. Okay, next uh, I bought this pink hoodie from H&M. It's very nice. It has a very small heart shape on uh, logo at the side and it is I think 169 Hong Kong dollars which is about 30 Sing dollars la. yeah. it's not the cheapest but it's very pretty I really like it and it's pretty thick quite warm yeah I think but you can wear it in Singapore too Singapore's weather in aircon yeah in aircon room or in the library it's pretty good I like it good buy I'm very happy with it and what do you buy? Um, I bought this skirt you see from Mongkok Center. It's like the only thing we bought in Mongkok Center because everything is winter clothes. So there's nothing much. Yeah, it's very pretty but we can't buy it. <laughs> so this skirt is not very thick, it's quite thin. And it's like $49.90, so it's less than $10 thing. And it's quite worth it. It's my style, it's an Elan plated skirt. So I bought this pair of jeans from American Eagles of It is on discount, $179. Hong Kong dollars. Yeah, this printed and free, free, free ends kind of thing. I really like it. It's so pretty and it's like 30 SGD. So she wore it back. Yeah, I wore it already. So yeah, <laughs> I, I like it. It's quite worth it. It's quite nice too. Mm. Okay, Next, but last but the um, last the last clothing things are yeah. all from 68. So we will see. But we actually spent a lot, lot, lot of money on 68. Totally splurge at 68. 68. The it's two amazing. of us plus our friend Rachel. Yeah. We spent about 2k plus Hong Kong dollars in 68. Yeah, you will know why. So later, later we'll show you. So the first thing is, I bought this sweater. So cute. Okay, the key look. is the, the the hoodie here has two like, years. Mm, look at it's so this. Cute. It's so It's very cute. How much this is this? Is, um, 99.90. 99.90. So it's is. less than $20 Hong Kong dollars. I can wear it whenever I go yeah. overseas and stay in a hotel. In the aircon room. So comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now I think I bought um I bought a pajama shorts. <laughs> because it's $29.90. It's six dollars. So like why not? It's very comfortable. It's a very nice soft material you can wear to sleep. Yeah. And then let's let's share with you why we spend so much money at 68. Because we actually bought a lot of uh, stuff. Yeah, a lot of If you don't know what 68, what kind of shop 68 is, yeah. maybe you can visit uh, Vivo City, Bugis, and, and Japanese one. one. There's this pink colour shop that yes. sells mainly brass and panties. Lingerie. <laughs> so we bought a lot of lingerie there. A lot of like, pen underwear. Yeah, like most, most of them are 5 for 169. So it's 5 for 30 dollars. And Slightly cheaper than Singapore. Singapore is 5 for 34 95 yeah. But they have a lot more designs and options for you to choose from. They also have this like specific few that are on sale. So 5 for $68. Hong like Kong five, dollars which yeah. is 5, five for, for 12? about 12 This is super cheap. It's like yeah. one panty for like $2. <laughs> and panties of course they bought bras Bra. and a lot of uh, bralettes. bralettes. Okay, okay. Let's just show you the bralette lah. If you oh visit the 68 store in Singapore, they sell one of these at $13.90. It's original price, but it's on sale there, so it is. Can you see? Oh no. $29.90, which is less than $16. So it's a very good buy. I'm very happy with it. I bought a lot of Most of these stuff. are like $29.90, $49.90. $49. Anyway, if you go to Hong Kong, right, uh, for clothes, we actually would recommend you to go to Mongkok Center. Yeah. yeah, but not for winter. Uh, but there's nothing about Yeah, for girls, uh, because it's. Summertime is all Taobao kind of clothes. It's, it's very, very cheap. It's much cheaper than in Singapore. So then, 68 is another love of our life in Hong Kong. We've been buying their lingerie since 2017, so we love them. Okay. Yeah, that's our that's rec for clothes recommendations yes. for. Uh, Hong Kong. Kong. Oh, we haven't do a. We forgot to do a recommendations on skincare and uh, makeup. But I think you guys probably know la, It's Sasa and Bonjour, right? Yeah, mainly Sasa la. Mainly yeah. Bonjour and all this kind of stuff. Then I think you should go Sasa, Bonjour, and Color Mix. The rest a bit dubious la, Don't go. Yeah. Yeah. 
they have. Because uh, sometimes it's so cheap to a point that you you don't know if it's real. real. Yeah. So you better not. But don't like, waste it. <laughs> he also bought a few pairs of earrings. Yeah, we got them from Mongkok Center. Yeah, this well. is the other thing we bought from Mongkok yeah. Center. Other than food and drink club. But. They were like 3 for 100 Hong Kong dollars. Quite so nice, right? 3 for about 20. So yeah, it's cheap. about Lovisa offer price. The uh, next thing we bought is socks. So, uh, right beside Mongkok Center, right, there's a sock shop. They sell 8 pairs for 100 Hong Kong dollars, which is about 20 dollars. So one is about two two fifty, sing. So we got we shared with Rachel lah, so we got four pairs here. And this is hers. So cute, never heart shape. So cute. <laughs> and I got my favorite, all time favorite, cartoon stitch as usual. And then two more. Yeah. Lin Bao Chao Ren Rat. I've no idea what it's called in English, but and Gude Tama. So cute, isn't it cute? <laughs> so it's it, this, uh, this socks from More 68 socks. it is actually five pairs for 68 hong kong dollars la, but i gave one away to a burden but it's okay so i really nice i bought colors. this yeah because of the colors i really like this brick red color and this yellow so other stuff Stuff's i bought is this is a Luggage tag, pineapple luggage tag. Oh my god, so cute. She's obsessed with pineapples. <laughs> so it's a bit like, expensive, but uh, I bought it at like sixty eight Hong Kong dollars. I bought it at this the the price from five pairs of socks. I bought it at <laughs> Dim Sa Tui. I also got this gumbo notepad thing. Yeah, but this is ho- ten Hong Kong dollars. So when we went there, Lang Han Place was having the some Christmas, some Christmas stuff. event. Yeah. So they had like Disney store. And then this is ten Hong Kong dollars. I honestly don't know as a use of this, but just bought it because I she just likes it. Just bought it because I love Dumbo. And then I also bought postcards from Macau because we went to Macau for a day trip, lah. I didn't buy anyone from uh, Hong Kong because I really have. But I really like this one. Oh, it's really it, very pretty. But this watercolor kind of thing. And it's the it's the it feels like they really painted it. Yeah. The material. This is a chapel of Our Lady of Penha, and I. Got this other one. This is post office building. building. This is just a Sana Lu Square there la. A typical look one. So one is very very cheap. I think it's two or three Hong Kong dollars. So it's about 50, 60 cents. Very, very cheap. For those cards about. Yeah. It's very Especially cheap. Especially in like tourist area. What is that Taipa? The, the problem with tourist really. areas, right? That those cards are usually very ugly and very it's super expensive. expensive. Okay, lastly, let's move on to the food. food. So we bought some Ming Chan. What is Ming Chan? Just I don't a know. Typical souvenirs. Like everyone that yeah. goes to Hong Kong will buy them. First one is this. The Chinese Jenny cookies. They always change the packaging so it's Chinese New Year. And look at the bears. They are wearing the uh, tea pot. Not so cute. So I we, we bought the mixed one for mixed butter cookies large box. Actually quite nice. But Singapore has this like. Okay, and the next thing we bought is peanut candy. Mm. This is the Macau oh. peanut candy. Koi 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 and this that's the hard one. The crunchy one. Yes. I prefer the crunchy one. Like, I think both, both is good. Both you can try it in the store. Uh, we ate a lot in the store. Uh, so nice. So good. Yeah. It, so if you want to visit Macau, so you just go and try and buy a few. Because it's really quite nice. Yeah. Yep. And then the next few food items are actually our own personal favourites when we were having exchange in Hong Kong. So what we always buy Yay. then like snacks and all. So the first also one excited. is... This Kelby pizza flavored uh, chips. This is the Rishi Chi Cheda Ho which is Swiss and Cheddar cheese. So good. This is very good. There's a lot of different uh, pizza flavored ones. So make sure this is the best line in our opinion. So Actually, we like this yeah. the most. Is this logo? Another so, thing that we really really like. Is this? This is the Kelby uh Pi Fong Tang Chao Xia Wei Prawn Cracker. So it's basically directly translated into English as Typhoon Shelter Style Fried Prawn Flavored. Let me see. 
Yeah. Some people don't know that yeah. but Hong Kong no, has this is specific style of seafood cooking called like beef fong tang. So it's similar. basically very very strong uh, garlic taste lah. So if you like fried garlic, you will like it. Yeah. But if you don't like garlic, don't bother. Please don't try it. You hate it. Yeah. So so okay, good. the okay. last one is her favorite. My favorite. This is the best. I brought like so many, not a lot, a bit of it back. It's very heavy. This I bought two packets. Show packets back! Yeah, this is the BLT. The Vita BLT Ice Lemon Tea. It's the Se Te Chi. Whatever Ice Lemon Tea you have in life, they are all sugar water, they are fake. This is like amazing! So when we touched down, the first thing I did was like, buy Ice Lemon Tea. Yeah. She's obsessed with this Ice Lemon Tea, okay? I want to thank anyway, my friend. <laughs> yes. For helping me carry this bag. It's very heavy. I bought shelf. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's all the things that we bought from Hong Kong. A lot of food, a lot of clothes, a lot of makeup. I hope you <laughs> like this video and yeah, I hope you enjoy our recommendations and do buy them if you want to try it. Like, it's all buy pretty this. good. Yeah, she, she's obsessed with this lemon tea as you can tell. But yeah, do try them if you have it the chance and let us know in the comments if you like them or do you have any other recommendations that we don't know about Hong Kong yeah. from Hong Kong what to buy and oh. all yes yeah so let us know so bye, bye. bye. see you next time bye bye